Bayou Park is growing in Houston's East End, and today the expansion plans got a major boost from the Kinder Foundation. The $100 million gift will be put to use in Buffalo Bayou East. This is the area that starts around I-69 to the west and stretches just east of US-90 alternate. So what exactly does the donation mean for the Bayou and those neighborhoods surrounding it? We want to go now to KPRC2's Sabira Rayford, who joins us now live from the East End with those answers. Sabira. Keith, this is a massive 10 year, $310 million pet land, and a big part of it is connecting downtown to the East End community. Come on, Archie. Jonathan Cubetis and his dog are always outside. I walk him like three or four times a day. He's a new resident of the East End of town. We wanted to get in when we can. Because in 10 years, the waterway east of downtown and beyond will have undergone a $310 million transformation. This is a four way partnership, and we think that in and of itself is uh, pretty darn important. Rich Kinder and his Kinder Foundation is responsible for $100 million of what's being called Buffalo Bayou East. We believe this is just transformational. It's going to revitalize uh, this whole part of Houston. The rest of the money is coming from public and private partnerships. With the new trails and parks that we're, built, we're building, they'll be able to explore the bayou all the way into the East End. There's also an affordable housing project. Tony Moran Park will double in size to 40 acres. Several infrastructure improvement plans in Jaffin Creek will connect downtown using the Bayou Trail. I ride my bike all the time. I want to take some peaceful walks and when my family come and visit, definitely want to take them there and show them around. Stakeholders say a key objective is preserving culture and traditions. A 50,000 square foot warehouse on Navigation Boulevard will house the city's Hispanic History Research Center and archives. BBP says they reached out to more than 50,000 communities members. We don't want to forget about the history of this neighborhood and this is really important. This isn't Kinder's first time donating to the park in 2010. They donated $30 million to Buffalo Bayou Park, but this, however, is the largest donation in Houston Park's history. Reporting live in East End, Sabir Rayford, KPRC 2 News.